Good, and yourself? Good. Thanks for taking some time with us, dude. You're busy right now, aren't you? Uh, it's a little bit crazy, but I kind of got uh, this week to, to settle back in L.A. and get all my affairs in order for all these different projects I got going. Okay, now everybody's texting us right away about Twilight. What can you tell us? I mean, what's available for everyone to know that they don't already know? What's going to happen, dude? Man, so much happens in these uh, in, in these next two movies. We get to see the... Uh, <laughs> The consummation of uh, a relationship between Edward and Bella happen uh, once they're married, you know, that they've led this very chaste relationship, and so now we get to see them uh, kind of have their unbridled physical display of love. You're like, damn, girl. Now, our listener, Megan, texted in to 49330, and she wants to know about your new movie, Girlfriend. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, Girlfriend is a movie that I produced with the Patchmo Entertainment, which is my production company in association with Wayne Lauren Film Company, and I acted in the film, composed the music with my band, 100 Monkeys. Wow. And, yes. Uh, and produced. It was fun. It was fun to kind of go in there and uh, kind of try all, all three different things at once. Where'd you watch the Oscars from? Uh, from my living room. Okay. How'd you think that Anne and uh, Putsy did? What'd you call them? I called Putsy. it Putsy. It was gross. I mean, Putsy. it was just awful, wasn't it? I, I, I don't know. I don't uh, know. Well, it's 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 one of those things, you know. It's 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 hard to be kind of on the new guard, you know, because like it's it's a passing of the torch, and uh, you know, it's, it seems like you know it's not always, you know, it's a an easy swift transition. To, you know, this you're so nice and PC. <laughs> I mean, I, oh, I I get that you want to get the movie. I don't know about PC. Up. I'm yeah. just trying to look at you know like both sides of the coin here. You know, yeah. it's, like, it's one thing to be all like, oh, they were terrible, but to be like up there doing it yourself, uh, uh, you know, that's a little more terrifying. Now, Jackson, go ahead and lift the curtain just a little bit for all the Twilight fans out there. Give us some dirt about what goes on behind the scenes. Like, does someone spend too much time at craft service? Does someone toot a lot? <laughs> so, I, I like how your first question is, does, does someone fart a lot? Well, she's got a You never like know. A, it's a morning show, you know. You got to keep awake. And, you know, sometimes uh, you just got to pass one off. To, yeah. You know, <laughs> to keep you away. Um, I, see, I see. I see how it is. No worries. No worries. I, I think it's one of those things. There aren't really too many uh, <laughs> like juicy, gossipy tidbits I, I can hand you, but uh, I, I will say that this is uh, this is going to be uh, an amazing culmination of, of the saga and the series, and I think people are going to be uh, really excited once it, it gets to the theaters. Now, you were born in Singapore. You've lived all over the world, traveled, of course, for your job, and you reside in L.A. Now, what is it about L.A. that everyone just loves? You can't really beat the weather here in Los Angeles, can you? Yeah. Uh, it's, it's beautiful. I mean, uh, it's, I'm watching the, uh, the sunrise today, and it's just, uh, yeah, you know, I wake up in the morning, and I thank God I'm alive, you know, so I get to kind of witness these natural wonders of the world. Oh, my God. Now I see why everyone watches Twilight. That was beautiful. Again, we're kicking it with Jackson Rathbone and Jasper from Twilight. We do this thing in, in the Playhouse every morning. It's called our Subway Secret Sound, where basically we got just a mad amount of cash up for grabs, and for all the celebrities that come on the show, we give them the option of nailing down the secret sound. And if you can tell us what it is, we'll give the money to your favorite charity, okay? Beautiful. All right, man. So I want you to listen to this really, really close. And I know it's probably the first time you're hearing it. I want you to listen one more time, man. Okay, so for $531.41, Jackson Rathbone from Twilight, what is the Playhouse secret sound? Would that be a rotary telephone? Oh, my God. God. No way. No. It's not. No. It's wow. not. You, you really built me up there. Jackson Rathbone, thank you so much for coming on with the Playhouse. I know all the girls out there, they are drooling blood because they just can't wait for those Twilight movies to come back. So hopefully we can have you on before they hit theaters. You are Jasper and Twilight. You have a great day. All right. Thank you. Have a good morning.